Um, three bodies have been discovered and the families are around they have identified their, their loved ones and that is it however the operation started yesterday we got the distress call at about 9 p.m. and on turning out immediately we walked throughout the night it was this morning that we were able to recover those bodies and last year we had only one casualty this year we have three so far. We don't know. We are yet to announce in the estate so that if there is anyone who has not seen a member of his or her family, they should report to the police station so we can continue with the search. The search is ongoing until we get to know that there is no more casualty. When there is flood water above a particular height, don't drive your vehicle across it. And still, they are doing that. I think one young man we are trying to remove his vehicle there was in that vehicle. He abandoned the vehicle and left. And the thing took the vehicle. He's alive. So if people should adhere to simple advice and warnings, we won't have much casualties. As we arrived this morning, we continue the search. You have gotten the whole information. Three dead bodies. The only advice we are giving to residents is that they should adhere to warnings. They should adhere to warnings and advice from NEMA or volunteers, from FCT emergency or any other disaster manager. All of us, it's our business. All of us must put hand in solving this problem.